I'm relieved to finally hear the judge say that he is guilty. The mothers of two young boys react after learning the man who molested their children will spend decades behind bars. Good evening, I'm Jeff Smith. And I'm Nicole Kahn. Thanks for being with us tonight. Stephen Quick was convicted of three felony counts of child molestation this morning. And now he faces up to 150 years in prison for videotaping sex, uh, sex acts with three young children. Kristen Mayorano has the story. 32-year-old Stephen Quick was found guilty just minutes after an hour-long recess. Judge Susan Orr Henderson had just watched about 45 minutes of video documenting Quick and his girlfriend Samantha Light's sex acts on three children under the age of seven. Of course, I think it's fair and just. I thought it was a little lengthy to take for it to come out, but it's just a relief to hear it. Larissa Smith's son was six when he was molested by Quick and Light. At the time, Light was a close friend of Smith's. Betrayal doesn't, it's not even a strong enough word. There is not a more a powerful enough word to, to describe the feeling. I'm hoping that um, he will get what he deserves. I'm hoping that he will get a life sentence. Angela Heyman's son was only one when he was videotaped by the Vetersburg couple. Heyman and Smith say they are angry about what happened to their sons, but they say Quick's conviction gives them the closure they need to move on. He's a smart, bright little boy. He's, you know, he's, he's fine now, and he's not greatly affected, and he, he's got a great support system, big family, lots of people that love him. I just want to say thank you to everyone out there that has been praying for us, for what we're going through, and just keep us in your prayers, and likewise, we will keep you in ours. Quick will be back in court for his sentencing hearing on May 13th. Kristen Mayorano, News Channel 18.